Okay, the igniter control for the spark is naturally collect, connected here. So if you're changing the igniter control, first we remove this cap, unscrew this cap, then connect it to the switch here, the starter switch. There's another plug down here. Okay, go down under. This plug here needs to be unplugged. It just unplugs like that. So now you've separated the switch and the spark plug and we can now unscrew the control unit that has the circuitry that starts the spark. So this is the sparking unit that we're removing now. You also have to undo it there. Don't lose any of the nuts and bolts. And we have the sparking unit that if faulty would need replacing. You can now slide out of from underneath there like that and you have it free and loose. Okay, stop.